long time ago, in a country that no longer exists, a genius was born. You know, life is a chemical incident. From a very young age, Dr. Ehrlich believed that all life was based on a chemical language. In 1896, at age 42, kind and famously absent-minded, Dr. Ehrlich opened his first lab in a building that had been a barn. He worked endless hours with Fritz by his side in pursuit of his defining theory that scientists could communicate with cells and the drivers of most diseases. But science had not yet accepted that cells could even cause disease. Ehrlich was attacked and denounced, especially by his nemesis, the bitter and unimaginative Dr. Max von Gruber. His work is shameful fantasy. Ehrlich was in search of what he called a magic bullet, targeted therapies that could seek out disease within, attack and remove it. This concept led the way for the breakthrough that saved millions of lives around the world and fostered discoveries that treated millions more. This was his magnificent obsession. Ehrlich laid the foundation for biologic medicines, tools we use today to fight cancer. What was once the dream of a Prussian schoolboy, a chemical language, now allows us to disrupt cell signals, combine therapies, and target the biology of disease. Imagine what we will discover tomorrow.